All right, so uh, we're going to take a look at uh, variadic parameters and unfurling a slice. And um, we are in uh, this code base here at GitHub, goes to 11, Golang Web Dev, so you can find the code there. And this entire course, we're just talking about it, is right there at Greater Commons, so check it out. <laughs> so uh, let's do unfurling a slice. And unfurling is my word. It's a, uh, you know, like you unfurl a sail. It's not go official from the documentation. I just like it. Because if I have xi colon equal slice event and, uh, and then I have a funk that takes in as a parameter a value of slice of int and then it's going to uh, let's do this um, let's start with that let's see what happens and we could format print line that I I and then we could call foo and pass in X I and I'm gonna run it and this is 24 0 24 so I printed it out what if I had this So that's a variadic parameter, and I'll take an unlimited number of ints. So we've seen that here in the font package. When we're looking at it, here it takes an unlimited number of values of type interface, empty interface, so of any type. So, uh, where do I want to be? I could do that with ints too, but I'm passing in a slice of ints. Those are two different types. Because with foo, I could pass in three. That's going to run. But look, it made it a slice. So when I ask for something like that, the type is slice of int. So that's what it's like an unlimited number of ints, a variadic parameter. But I could unfurl this slice. I call it unfurling. So I could pass in all of those ints. I like the dot notations, like yeah, yeah, yeah. All this stuff, and so what's that? What that's going to do is gonna, it's going to pass in one, two. It's going to pass in these values without them being in a slice. It's just going to be passing the numbers by commas, and then it will put them back into a slice here. It's kind of weird, but it's just kind of good. It's good to know about. Interesting, right? Just some of the syntax to know about. So that's unfurling a slice. There's nothing really more to say about it. Anybody have questions? You want to try it? Or good enough? It's just something to be aware of. Because you see this notation dot dot dot. That's a variadic parameter. So I'll take an unlimited number of values of type int. If I wanted to, I could have passed in. Two, like one, two, four, five, seven, eight, nine, right? I could have passed that in, and I get the same thing. So what happens when you pass in xi dot dot dot? It's unfurling xi into those numbers, and uh, and then it's 
pushing them out and putting them in there. Yeah, that's unfurling a slice. Variadic parameter, uh, a variadic parameter, unlimited values of type that can be passed in.